Hey guys, Lacey Elizabeth here. Guess what? We all love him. Painted by Spencer just launched his brand new liquid highlight. This is his... What? I bought this in November? And I just got it? Okay, um... Spencer? What? <laughs> Seriously, this launched in November and I'm reviewing it now because I just got it. That's crazy. All right, guys, I'm going to try this on, test this out, and of course, give this product a score. Spencer, sweetie, we gotta do something about the shipping, like seriously. All right, guys, let's get into this video. I'm excited. I'm gonna actually put a little bit of this on my table. I think that's probably way too much, to be honest with you, but this is it right here. This So this is almost like a champagne -y color. I'm just gonna swatch this on the back of my hand for you guys. That is stunning. And of course, I super love Spencer. He's an amazing makeup artist and a fellow YouTuber, so shout out to him. I'm actually going to try this on and test this out two different ways. I'm going to apply it over my makeup as a highlight and under my makeup to make my makeup glow so I get that natural, dewy, glowy finish. So let's get into this. I'm gonna go in with this foundation brush right here. I'm just gonna pick up a little bit of that product, stipple it right here. I just wanna see how much I grab on the back of my hand. Okay, that's pretty good. I'm going to go in on top of my foundation and just apply this right here as a glowy highlight to the upper cheekbones. Okay, that's really pretty. I kind of like that. It's a lot more subtle than I thought it would. I'm just gonna pick up a little bit more of that product. I'm actually gonna go in with my fingertip and just really pat that in right where I want it. Okay. For a liquid highlight, that's actually super, super pretty. Not mad at the weight anymore. That is actually really, really nice. It's not terribly frosty. It doesn't give me like a super amount of like in your face. Okay, like, you know, she's beaming, but this is just absolutely stunning and I actually really like it. All right, so now I'm gonna go in, pick up the rest of that product and I'm going to just apply this all over this side of my face to give my makeup just like a dewy finish and I'm going to apply foundation over that. This is blending out like a dream. Absolutely no issues whatsoever. Okay, even just that, that's giving me glow, hydrating, illuminating, like that's, that's stunning. So for my foundation today, I am gonna be using this one right here by Rose Ink, and this is the Skin Enhance Illuminous Tinted Serum. If you guys have not seen my video on this, my review, this is phenomenal. Definitely check this out. You just need to see it to believe it. This is fantastic. The formulation is just stunning. So I'm just gonna take a little bit on the back of my hand, one pump. Again, you're gonna see it's all pixelated. That's okay, I'm gonna go in with the same brush and I'm just going to break that up. It's gonna create the skin tint. Isn't that amazing? I think that's so awesome. And I'm just going to go in and apply that foundation. Okay, so that's really pretty. So far, I really like it. It's giving me that extra luminous glow I probably should have gone in with like a NARS matte foundation or something like that, but this one I had in front of me. I love this foundation, like love, love, love this foundation. I think it's so beautiful. Okay, let me know what you guys think in the comments down below. Do you guys love this product as much as I do? It's time to give this product a score. Starting with application. All right, so this applied beautifully. I have really nothing negative to say about it. It just went on effortlessly and perfect. I'm gonna have to give this one a 10 out of 10. Up next, pigment. All right, so this is actually only one shade, which makes me sad. I feel like I would like at least a more of a rosy tone because this is kind of a gold champagne color. And it does look beautiful on my skin and it will look beautiful on all skin types. I just feel like I like a more of a rosy, you know, rose gold tone 
kind of liquid highlighter. It is a personal preference, but I do like this quite a bit. So I'm going to give this one a 7 out of 10. Moving on to texture and finish. This is gorgeous. I like the way it's sitting on my face. It is definitely giving me that plexiglass glass skin glow. I applied it all over under my foundation on this side and it is phenomenal. Right here, I just applied it just kind of on like an upper cheekbone highlight. Again, super, super pretty. I like both sides. It's not emphasizing any texture that I have right here, so I like that a lot. I am going to give this one a 7 out of 10. And finally, value. This is 35 US. I didn't have to pay any duty on this one coming over the border because obviously I'm in Toronto, Canada. But I, I honestly think that's kind of like on par for a good, really good liquid highlighter. Not mad at it. I'm going to give this one a 10 out of 10 for a value, bringing us to a final score of 34 out of 40. Now, should you buy it, wishlist it, or avoid it? This is really beautiful, but I'm going to be real with you guys. Spencer launched this in November. And now I actually received this through UPS in February. No joke. I just got this. This is insanity. This <laughs> has to be probably the thing that probably took the longest for me to get in shipping. And I get it. Logistics. Like there's COVID. There's all sorts of things happening in the world. But this took forever to get. Now, if you want to try this, I completely recommend it. But if you live outside the U.S., know that it's going to take a hell of a long time to get to you. If you love videos like this, make sure you smash that like button and subscribe to the channel so you guys don't miss when I drop another video. Mwah. Live, love, and lip gloss. Bye, guys. Bye.